Welcome to the Garmin True Swing Golf Club Swing Sensor. This video will help you analyze parts of your swing with 3D swing metrics. Pair True Swing with your smartphone and open the Garmin Connect mobile app. Select your club and take your shot. Now you can see a 3D animation of your swing. Let's break it down. We'll start with swing speed, or the speed of the club head when it hits the ball. This determines the distance of your shot. Swing tempo is the ratio of timing of your backswing to your downswing. A 3 to 1 ratio is best. Face to target angle is the angle of your club face in relation to your target path or the direction the club face points at the start of the swing. The metric shows whether this angle is open or closed. Club path illustrates your club's horizontal motion from overhead. It can be in-out or out-in. Shaft lean at address measures the forward or backward angle when you're holding the club. It's measured from a 90-degree vertical angle. While shaft lean at impact is the forward angle or backward angle you're holding the club when you hit the ball, measured from a 90 degree vertical angle. It determines the amount of dynamic loft in your stroke. And dynamic loft is the loft angle of the club face at impact, plus or minus the loft offset from the shaft lean and club face. That is, angle the club backwards and you'll get more loft offset. Angle it forward and you'll get less. The shaft angle at address is the angle between the shaft and the ground as measured from the center of the shaft. Finally, the shaft angle at impact is the angle between the shaft and the ground as measured from the center of the shaft when the club hits the ball. It's that simple. Learn more features of the Garmin True Swing Sensor by watching the other videos in this series.